Well, good morning. It is 9.15. I just went over and did a spray tan. Marty and MJ are at Coffee and Cars. Um, we might, I don't know if I mentioned this to you guys last week, we might paint the bathroom today, the master bathroom. Uh, just because the paint they had in there was A, a horrible color, and B, it was like a really, it wasn't made for a bathroom, so it was really matte. And Marty goes in in the morning and turns the water on hot and, you know, gets ready and takes a while. <clears throat> and the water's running, and so it, um, it's gotten like, water marks on it and it's gross and so we are going to go through and we are going to go through and repaint it possibly today if he finds a color he likes um so we'll go check that out later on today there's a really good paint i think it's by bear at uh, home depot that's like a one coat one that we used when we did mj's room so we might go do that and uh we have a birthday party tonight next door at our neighbor's house for our other neighbor's 60th birthday. So we're going to go over there for that. And um, yeah, I don't know. Marty and MJ may go to the gym. I'm going to run home and get ready. I just got out of the shower and figured I'd go do a spray tan. And uh, now I'm going to go get ready, ready. You know, like wash, not wash my face out, do my makeup and uh, brush my hair and get my hair done and all that good fun stuff so yeah I have no idea what this weekend is gonna be bring I'm just kind of going with the flow it's nice to be home and not really have anything crazy next weekend we'll be away so I'm kind of excited to just have a you know another weekend to just do whatever we feel like all right so while the boys are gone I am going to sit down and relax for a little bit and watch some TV I think I'm going to watch uh, American Horror Story or Nashville, I'm not sure which one, and um, catch up on those from this week. I just tied my hair up because if we end up painting, I'm not doing my hair to have to do it again later on tonight because um, <clears throat> I'm just going to curl it before we go out tonight anyway. Um, it's kind of a mess, but whatever. On my eyes, Kat Von D palette, I've got um, those two colors mixed together that I showed in my review and then the like crease cut just a little bit with it um unique 3d mascara Giorgio Armani lasting silk foundation today the Kat Von D like shade and light palette for setting Shiseido sun protection powder Marc Jacobs lip liner I don't know I think those are about everything all right so this master bathroom is the worst master bathroom ever but you see the water stains it's horrible need some light bulbs they have this weird box on the wall. And then it has the world's tiniest shower, which is why I get ready upstairs. And then just a toilet and a cabinet. Nothing special, but we will see what it looks like when we are done. I'll get them for Daddy. Okay, get Daddy some peanuts. You gotta open another one. No, I'll eat this one. Okay. Another peanut out? Tell me how you crack it with your hand. Oh, that way? So we've patched all the holes, painted the ceiling. I'm finishing up over there, as you can see by the ladder. Did all the baseboards um, all around. Painted the back of the door again. All that good fun stuff. Um, so next tomorrow will be the actual paint. Moving out real quick over to Home Depot <laughs> um, to get a different blue paint. The one Marty got, um, he wanted a light blue, but I don't think he fully got the whole concept that, you know how when you look at a paint chip in the store it always seems lighter than what it is like on your wall well he got this blue that he thought was like a light blue but you know just not too bright but had some color to it, it wasn't like a whitewash blue either and uh it's so bright like it looks like it's i don't have any on my hand i got a bunch of paint on my hand but not that one it it's like 
it's 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 too bright. So I'm going to go get another one. Um, MJ didn't want to go to Home Depot, so Marty was like, "You just go pick it as long as it's blue and good." So I was going to paint the walls tonight, but that's not going to get done. I guess I'll be done tomorrow because it's five o'clock now, and we had to put MJ to bed at seven, and then get ready and go next door for the party. Oh, pretty cool. So for dinner tonight, we're going to be having this beef pot roast, which is actually, I've shown you guys before, it's really easy. You cook it in a pot. Um, right now I have a pot of salt water that I'm getting ready to bring to a boil. Might as well turn that on. And I'm going to put some whole potatoes in it. And then I'm going to chop up some onion and some carrots, and I will then roast these all together. These I first parboil in salt water and then roast them. It makes them really Awesome. It is 8.51. MJ and I are on our way to his gymnastics class. And I say gymnastics, <clears throat> sorry that the sun is horrible, because um, the place is actually called My Gym. And they're all over the U.S. Um, they're a franchise. But if I say we're going to My Gym, <laughs> he used to get confused with the gym that we go to, the arena club. So um, it, we call it gymnastics. And because he does learn things like how to do somersaults and balance and things like that, that are all really good for him. <clears throat> for November and December, because they're their slower months and through the holidays, they have unlimited classes for November and December. So even if you pay for the one a week, which is what um, their membership is, you can go as many or as little times as you want. And he loves it there. It's an hour that I get to sit. I usually take my computer with me and I just get a little bit of work done and I watch him. Like, it's really nice. I don't have to stay there. I can go to Starbucks. Um, I just don't bother to go to Starbucks anymore, honestly, because A, I end up buying and eating things that I don't need <laughs> or don't want. And B, because I can sit at the gymnastics place and get the same things done that I would get done at Starbucks. So um, that's what I have been doing, which is nice. And uh, so Marty is off, not off, off, but meaning off and away, flying to Florida. He will be back late, late Wednesday night. Um, I have two Stella and Dot shows this week on Tuesday and Thursday evening. Um, they're just Facebook parties. They're 30 minutes. It's, you know, you can do it from anywhere. Everybody gets to just sit in front of their computer or wherever they're comfortable and just, you know, relax and just chat and see some images and talk about some things and get some information that way. So I have two of those coming up this week and I am, uh, yeah, I'm just getting that done. This is crazy this morning. So I can't think of anything else. I have no idea really. This week's a little bit crazy because we have to leave on Friday to go to Connecticut for a wedding this weekend. <clears throat> so I have to figure that stuff out, what I need to take with me and all that. Shouldn't be too much because we're only going Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So yeah, so that's pretty much it for now. Um, dinners won't be very exciting this week because it's just me at home. So I picked up a couple of things at Wegmans when we went yesterday. <clears throat> a tilapia, a, a shrimp scampi, and a steak thing. And uh, when Marty comes home for Thursday night, we're just having tacos, which is pretty quick and easy. So I think that is everything for now that I can think of. and I are going to the Waffle House. He decided he wanted some brunch. <laughs> he wanted some waffles and eggs. So we're going to go in the I Waffle House and grab a bite to eat. There. Okay. All right. So we're still working on it, but this is the color. It's kind of hard to tell with that light. It looks a little bit brighter in this than, wow, it makes that tub look yellow too. That's funny. It's like an off-white, but we're getting there. Deciding if we need another coat or not. You can tell how light it is. Like, well, actually, it looks brighter against that white. But yeah, so we're getting there. 
We got some blue mats for now. I'm not sure about that floor. This bathroom is the worst bathroom ever. We need to replace a lot of stuff in it. are just left and I went and got my nails did I changed the shape a little bit it's hard to say this this is Mark Jacobs Petra um, and I went to the grocery store went to the post office and had to exchange a bra that I got the wrong one um, from Victoria's Secret and then I came home so it's five o'clock I'm home and uh, I'm just gonna settle in I'm getting ready to cook uh, tilapia for me and uh, MJ's gonna have some pizza tonight so That'll be everything, and then I'm just relaxing tonight. Thing about Wegmans is you can buy these single serving meals. So I'm having tonight garlic parmesan tilapia is my dinner for the night. So this is what it looks like before it goes in. We'll see afterwards. Pretty good. Too. I think I'm gonna add a little bit extra parmesan cheese and kind of toss it back in there for a couple minutes. Now it's done. A little bit more crispy, a little bit more cheesy. Well, good afternoon. I think I forgot to tape this morning. <laughs> uh, this morning got up and went to the gym. Uh, went to my um, trainer and then I dropped MJ off at school and today was what was today at school picture. picture day so they had pictures and then I came home I got showered dressed ready I had to put the links on my blog for tomorrow and uh, that's pretty much all I got done and then I went to pick them up and now we are going to go get where are we gonna go right now you don't know the car wash we're gonna go get the car wash my car has been sitting outside instead of in the garage because our convertible got a flat tire like a gash in it and they can't find the place that does our car can't find one of those tires in the state of Maryland so they're having to have it shipped in and so it hasn't come in yet but when the tire got flat we put the car caddy corner in the garage so that um, if they if the tire is so flat that we can't get the car back over to the place to get it fixed because we didn't want the car sitting there they didn't know how long it was going to take to find the tire so we didn't want the car just sitting there and possibly something happening to it so we kept it at our house in the garage but we put it like sideways not like completely sideways but kind of like crooked uh, in between the two spots so that if for some reason we have to have them come to the house to do the tire <clears throat> the car isn't up against a garage wall so it's been sitting there for it's been a week and a half and they're still trying to find the tire so um my car and his car have been outside which kind of sucks because next week he was going to take that car up north and put it in the garage up there so this winter we could have both cars in our garage that is one regret i have about our house we should have bought a house with a three car garage that is the only regret i have about my house we talk about that all the time, like our next house has to have a three car garage. It's just ridiculous. This is just silly. So yeah, um, so hopefully they'll have a tire in before he leaves next week after Thanksgiving, but I don't know if that's gonna happen. So MJ and I are heading to get the car washed, then we're gonna go home. We don't really have anything planned this afternoon. Marty's out of town, but um, Maybe I'll contact my neighbor and see if the girls want to come over and play or if they want to have us over and play. And uh, yeah, that's what we'll probably do. I'm just cooking at home tonight. Well, I'm gonna make this pasta that I had from Wegmans. Um, we were at a party on Saturday night and they had it catered by Wegmans. And there was this pasta and it's basically a really thin capellini pasta. It has an Asiago cheese, but it's a soft Asiago cheese. Um, chopped up inside of it it has a bruschetta like mixture in with it a little bit of olive oil and I think that's everything and it was awesome it was so good so I found the recipe for it and I am going to make that tonight and I also have a shrimp scampi 
it's just like a bunch of shrimp from Wegmans in a thing. So that is what we will be having, to, or I'll be having tonight. Is the car getting clean? Yeah. Is it doing a good job? Is it fast? Yeah. Yeah. It's so fast. <laughs> so fast? I didn't uh, know it was so fast. You didn't? Even though those brushes are so fast. Those brushes are really fast. This sweater I have, by the way, I get asked about this every time I wear it, and it is so old. It's like super, super long. It's like a blanket. It can wrap all the way around you. It's so cozy, warm, and comfy. It is awesome. I love it with just a t-shirt, and I get so many compliments on it. Um, just figured I'd tell you guys in case you were wondering. And I have on the cherry pendant. Love this with a white right, t-shirt. Here's what you need. It's a thing up. I'm going to do a half a recipe. I brought enough stuff for a whole. Uh, so you use a whole box of this. Eight ounces of Asiago cheese. Um, two cups of, this is from their olive bar, but it's bruschetta mix. I forget how much of the hot pepper garlic sauce. Um, and then a little bit of basting oil from them. I forget how much of that. But these are the main ingredients. So I'm going to get... So it's two tablespoons of this. And I used one. And then it's a quarter cup of this. So I'm not... I'm going to add that last. Because I only want to put a little bit of what I have. Um, and then I'm going to do one cup of this. And I might do all of the cheese. Just because I like the cheese anyway. Alright. So I chopped up... I chopped up the cheese and put it in. Um, it looks like I'm making about a three quarters order. This is how much cheese I have left. Just to give you an idea. And I might add more if I feel like it. And the basting oil I'm not putting in until so it's all mixed together. And now I just have to wait for the pasta. All right, so here's what it looks like. And I'm just going to put it in the fridge to cool it off. It's actually served cold. I guess you could serve it hot too, but you're supposed to serve it cold. So just so you know, I did not end up adding any of that because this has kind of an oil to it. And so I added an extra scoop of this because it gave it a little bit more flavor. And then I added the remainder of the bruschetta mix to it just because I felt like I didn't need this if I did those so This things. is what it looks like now, right before dinner. Next thing up for dinner tonight is the shrimp scampi along with that pasta. Uh, the tilapia was just okay. So we'll give this one a shot tonight. So the scampi looks good. Now let's just try it. <laughs> so I actually decided the best way to eat this was to put the shrimp over the pasta and eat them together. Well, good morning. It is 8.45 and MJ and I are on our way to the gym. I'm going to take cycling class and MJ is going to do tots today out on the field. Oh, the sun's starting to come out, that's nice. Um, we're gonna have sunglasses with me, that's not nice. <laughs> um, so we're gonna do that and then uh, MJ's school has a little project going on where they're collecting pennies. Um, there's a whole reason behind it, but MJ and I are going to go through all the change jars in the house today and collect the pennies for that so we can take it to school tomorrow. And then MJ has lacrosse today, this afternoon, and then we have nothing later on. So that's kind of nice. Um, maybe we'll go, well, we went down to my neighbor's last night, so maybe they'll come to our house tonight and the girls will play with MJ. Um, but yeah, nothing too exciting today, just kind of a chill day. Well, good afternoon. It is 3.30. I just got done in the shower, took a shower, and uh, I'm just in some comfy clothes because I had on comfy clothes. MJ said, it's like a cold, dreary day, and it's been raining on and off. He says, oh, he says, you have on your PJs? Can I put on my PJs? So MJ and I are having a PJ afternoon now. So um, I'm just going to make some dinner from for us. I have no idea what I'm going to make. It's going to be whatever's in the fridge. I'm not going to lie. And tonight I am going to be on a conference call talking um, with Stella and Dot. I'm kind of excited about it. So because I made uh, Star, which is the next level. So my team is now Star Team and I'm so excited <laughs> about it. So excited. The girls that work with me are so awesome and I'm really loving uh, just being a part of the Stella and Dot team and uh, the girls that work with me and under me are just amazing. I love them all and they're awesome. So I am just so happy right now. I can't even put it in words. Oh, they're in your bag. Well, good morning, guys. It is 8.30. MJ and I are on our way to school. Today he has a Thanksgiving feast. Uh, so Marty and I will go back to the school at 11. 
and uh, I got up and got like shower dressed and ready thinking oh perfect I have to get two videos done a um, bite beauty lip one that will have already been up and then also my video that will go up tomorrow my Stellan Dot holiday gift giving guide um, like it'll be ideas for things that are under $20 under $30 under $40 $50 etc <clears throat> plus there's a ton of specials going on right now and Black Friday sales so I'm gonna put it up tomorrow on Thursday so that you guys are aware before everything hits so um, I had gotten ready thinking oh perfect I'll just go do my spray tan after I drop him off and then I'll go home and sit down and you know boot these videos out and just fix up my hair and it is pouring rain when I say pouring rain I mean like pouring rain so I'm probably gonna have to fix my makeup some which isn't a big deal when I get home and I definitely have to fix my hair because it was down and now it's already up in a ponytail because it is so gross and wet out and I probably have to dry it now so um, and when I do my spray tan I put one of the hair nets also over my face so that I don't get sprayed in my face can you what um, you can go to daycare later today we're gonna go to school right now for the Thanksgiving feast yeah. You did? You saw the turkey on the sign. Yay. Yeah. So yeah, I do that so that I don't get tanner on my face because spray tanner because I don't want that on my face. Am I talking? Yes, buddy. There's a picture of lacrosse. Oh, there's a picture of lacrosse? That's because they know you like it. So I'm gonna go drop him off and I'll catch up with you guys later on. It's about 11 o'clock, 11 o'clock. I am heading back over to the gym to go to MJ's school uh, for the Thanksgiving and Marty is coming separate because he might have to leave early and get back, which is fine. It's nice that he can even come and do this. So um, he's going to come over separately and then maybe MJ and I'll pick up something for lunch. I'm trying to think of what I have at the house. Oh no, I have stuff at the house. We'll probably just go home and eat lunch. So I did get a chance to tape my Sephora gift uh, video and the Bite Beauty one, so that's good. And this is a Bite Beauty lipstick I have on right now. And uh, I've got a horrible headache. That sucks. So um, I just took an Excedrin and uh, I'm going to go over, do this, and then I have no idea what the rest of the day might be. Well, good morning. It is about 8 o'clock, almost 8 o'clock. Uh, just got ready real quick because we are going to be heading out to go to Connecticut for the wedding. So um, I forgot to tell you guys, last night I had a um, Stellan Dot trunk show and, um, ooh, some bright sun. And uh, it was an online one and um, with Hannah, who is awesome. What did I do with that? who her family was so sweet um, and it was totally fun to do. So we had a great time and now today I'm going to be in the car all day and I'm gonna try and get some editing done while I'm in the car. And yeah, my mom's coming here around 10 o'clock and uh, we'll just be on the road. So I will try and show you guys dinner later on tonight. Um, I don't even remember the name of the place we're going to. Uh, it is in Hartford, Connecticut. So I will catch up with you guys later on. getting ready here. I'm getting ready to pull my hair down. I had it back in a braid. Oh, half of it's falling out. Back in a braid today while we were driving so that when I got here, I could just touch it up with a curling iron and just make it really loose waves. Um, we are getting ready to go to dinner. Some, we have a suite. So we have a room up here and then that's 
downstairs is over there and there's a kitchen we're at one of those residence inns marriott's and so uh we're gonna have some friends come over ahead of time before we go to dinner and just hang out so i'll touch brush them out and touch them up yeah not bad we'll see